This video is in response to um, a suggestion I got on my channel a few months back. Someone suggested I try to run an old, quote-unquote, operating system on new hardware. I am a little bit cheating here doing this because they said Windows 95 and I'm doing Windows 98. I tried Windows 95 and it didn't work. I know there are workarounds, but I don't feel like sideloading drivers and patching the kernel right now. So I went the easy route and did Windows 98. The computer which I chose as the victim is the Compaq, uh, Compaq CQ2009F, which some of you may remember from a prior video that I declared it to be the worst computer I'd ever used. Well, I actually did find a use for it, other than target practice. Um, it is doing that challenge, which this is as close as I have gotten. Move that out of the way. So, what works and what doesn't? Um, pretty much every single thing doesn't work. I'm only able to do um, 16 color or 2 color at 640 by 480. 3D acceleration does not work, DirectX does not work, sound does not work. Uh, what do we have, what do we not have? So, this is everything that is not installed. We have no USB thumb drive, we have no audio, we have no network. We have no um, sleep-wake, we have no power management, meaning spin the hard drive down, etc. Um, we do not have audio, like I said. We do have the modem that's, that's enabled, because it's, um, it is a real tech chip, I believe. Um, we do have, it, it's re It's actually registering the SATA as IDE, which is, which is interesting. Um, the DVD drive is actually recognized. Um, monitor, I set it to a VGA panel, then 24 by 8. I set it to a VJ panel of 1280 by 1024. Um, the mouse is USB wireless, but it is registered as a PS2. Uh, the keyboard, again, wireless, but it's registered as an HID compliant. Besides that, nothing really works. Nothing really runs. And if we go to properties, it doesn't even register the RAM. Actually, it does. It says it's 1014 as opposed to 1024. And the Atom, Intel Atom, is saying it's an x86 Family 6 model, model 12, stepping 2. What does this mean? Well, it registers it as an Intel CPU. Project wise, I would say this is a failure because this system is not usable at all. I did not install Solitaire, but that's about it. So this video has been interesting, and yeah, this has been another video by Zesty Panda. Thumbs up, thumbs down, comment more suggestions, comment just anything, um, suggestions, challenges, ideas, comments about the video, what you thought, was it good, was it bad? just give general feedback. I will actually be doing this video twice, once with this camera, my S5, and once with this camera, just testing the quality. So thank you for watching, subscribe, rate, thumbs up, thumbs down, comment, and I'll have more videos soon.